Hey guys, I've got a fun video for you today. I'm gonna to be playing around with some of my favorite Pat McGrath products. And this video is sponsored by Pat McGrath. So a huge thank you to them for working with me on this video. And just a quick reminder that Sephora is having their spring savings event right now. And all the products that I'm gonna be uh, playing with today are available at Sephora. Of course, I'll link them down below in my description box. So let's go ahead and get started with some highlighter. So I do have, you know, foundation, concealer, powder, all that kind of stuff down, even some bronzer down. Um, so I wanted to start with this highlighting trio from Pat McGrath. The full name is Sublime Skin Highlighting Trio. And we've got three highlighters in here. This first one has like a pink shift to it. The middle one has like a little bit of a gold shift to it. And this last one is a deeper highlight, which is actually great for someone with my skin tone if you wanna kind of brighten up your bronze area. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and kind of go between these two highlights here, the pink and the gold, and just kind of dip between these two highlights. And these highlights are of a baked formula. So they go on in this really, really beautiful, uh, like sheer translucent like veil so so beautiful so i'm just gonna brush it right onto the tops of my cheekbones there can you see that Oof! like so many of pat mcgrath's products it's so intergalactic <laughs> her highlights so so pretty just gonna put some down the bridge of my nose maybe a little on my chin there I think I fall in love with this highlighting trio more and more every single time I use it. It's it's so pretty, so, so pretty. Okay, next, um, let's play with some eyeshadow. As you guys know, I think I just talked about this maybe in my recommendations video or, oh no, 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 I did a video, um, my five favorite products from five of my favorite brands. And of course I had Pat McGrath on there and I had to talk about this Blitz Astral Quad in ritualistic rose. It is so special. It's so, so beautiful. It's so special. It is all of her like baked formula shadows. So these are just like her four special shadows in her large mothership palettes. You know, those four shades over on the right hand side. It's like just a palette of those. Oh, I love it. So I'm just going to be using these for my eyeshadow. All right, so I'm gonna start with this shade down here. And I happen to really, really love this pink shade because it's almost like a bruised pink. It has like a little bit of like a cool purpley tone to it. And I, I love it. I think it's so, so flattering. So I am just gonna use my fingers. These shadows are very glittery and I find, even though I really love using brushes, I do find that applying them with your fingers works just as well, if not better sometimes. So I'm just gonna pick some up with my finger here and just lay it down. Oh, look at how wet and, and just stunning <laughs> this shadow is. So I just put this down like close to my lash line, the inner portion of my lid over to the center of my lid. And I'm gonna do the same thing over here. And then look at how the edges are like blended out it's so hard to find glittery eyeshadows that do that. Usually they're too uh, like PC or just not smooth enough to be able to do that. But her shadows, ugh, they just blend like a dream. All right, I'm gonna grab some of the brown shade down here and just add a bit to the outer corners here. And now I'm gonna grab a blending brush and just kind of blend it all out. And then I'm gonna grab some of this gold shade up here, just a little bit, and then just use that in the area here to kind of blend out my shadows. And that's it for eyeshadow. I mean, you end up with a really kind of like evening disco look, but it's so, it's so easy. Like you could use pretty much any combination of these four shadows. And I think you would just come up with like the coolest, like most fun look ever. I love that quad. All right, next, I'm going to use another one of my favorite products from her, but this is the Permagel Ultra Glide Eye Pencil in the shade Blitz Brown. You guys know how much I love a dark brown eyeliner that has like a little bit of something to it. And that's exactly what this eyeliner has. It has like a metallic sheen to it. 
and it's so, so pretty. So I'm gonna go ahead and run it along my upper waterline and then along my lower waterline. All right, eyeliner is on. I'm just gonna add some brows and curl my eyelashes and I'll be back to apply some mascara. All right, now for some mascara, here is the Pat McGrath Dark Star Mascara. I really, really enjoy this mascara if I want like a bold kind of lash. So let me just show you the wand if you're not familiar. And I'm gonna wipe some of the product off. So here is the wand. So it's kind of like a hourglass shaped natural bristle style wand. So there is just one coat and I feel like for the everyday, I'm good with one coat. I feel like I have a nice amount of volume. I added a little bit of length, but I'm gonna let that set a little bit and go in with a second layer for you guys, <laughs> just so you can see how beautifully this mascara builds up. So here's two layers, here's one layer. So you can see there's a considerable amount more volume over here. All right, and last but not least, lips. And you guys know how much I love the Pat McGrath Matte Trance Lipstick uh, Formula. This is another product I just recently talked about, I think in that five products video. I am not a matte lipstick lover, as you guys know, and I love this Matte Trance Formula. It is definitely one of the most comfortable formulas out there if you want a matte finish to your lipstick. So I'm gonna be playing with Divine Rose today. Let me give you a swatch. Oh, so smooth. Ooh, look at that beautiful pink. It's like just slightly cool toned. And Pat McGrath does the best cool tone matte lipsticks. So beautiful. So I have Starstruck. Let's see how that looks. So there is Starstruck next to it. I think that's actually a pretty good match. All right, there is Starstruck applied. Now let's go in with Divine Rose. Wow, so pigmented, these lipsticks. That was just one swipe. I smushed my lips together and that was enough for both the bottom and the top lip. And I do think that lip liner is like the perfect match. Oh, so, so comfortable. And not only is the Matte Trance like comfortable to put on, like it glides on really beautifully, it has a lot of pigment, but it's comfortable to wear, like as the day goes on. So even after it sets down a little bit, it doesn't feel drier, it doesn't get drier as the day goes on. It's, it's such a great, great formula. If you're someone like me who does not like the feeling of most matte lipsticks out there, but you like the look. I really like the look occasionally, especially if I'm doing something on the grungier side. I really like a matte lip. And these matte trans lipsticks are a dream. And like I keep saying, the color range of the matte trans lipsticks, gorgeous as well. I just love all of her shades. The tones are always like so spot on. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this demo of some of my favorite Pat McGrath products. Everything will be linked down below in my description box. And don't forget the Sephora Spring Savings event is going on. And a big, big thank you again to Pat McGrath for partnering with me on this video. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe down below if you haven't already, and I'll see you in my next video.